Hello everyone, it's me, BMA Double G, and welcome back welcome to the very first episode of Cobblemon! Yes, we gonna Yes, I wanna do Cobblemon because oh I've been wanting to try this mod out for a long time. Because I, I heard it's very popular and and I know I wanted to try this uh, mod out and I decided, you know what? I think it's time for me to start doing it. Yes, we are going to do Kawamon now. Alright, so if you already notice, I just started in the world. Um, I did, I spawned in the bonus chest. And yes, we got some Pokeballs right off the back. We got some tools, we got some wood, we got some bread. Yeah, but this is not only Kawamon because we actually have a lot of other mods enabled. I have some other mods I also have. Enabled? Oh yeah, we need to choose my starter. All right. So you're probably not. You're probably wondering what, whose starter I'm gonna go with for this. Well, it's gonna be Froki. Yes, I love Froki. I love its final evolution. Yeah, I love it. So I choose you. <laughs> so you actually um, you do get a guide for this. Um, yeah. So yeah. It's pretty cool guide, but it's pretty cool. All right, let's go ahead and get torch. Do that. All right, do you want me to do a first battle? Um, how about I get to some main key? All right. Holy crap! That fury. Holy crap! You hit ten times. Alright, I'll quick attack. Alright. Yay, Froki! Level 11! Alright. Return! I love that animation! I I look so cool. But, if you probably notice, um... If you probably notice, there are some of these trees around. You want to write quick some of these. Because you get acorns, and these are used to make the Pokeballs, yes. Yet, in order to make Pokeballs, you need acorns. So, yeah. And you need to find one of these apricorn trees. And and also, you get this apricorn log, which is, a, which is also a wood. Yeah, it's pretty cool. You make these apricorn planks, they look so fancy. Actually, they look very cool. Alright. Pretty cool. Yeah, um, you do get these leaves, and they're actually food swords you can use. Oh yeah, another thing I also did with this mod is I also installed some more food as well, so there will be a lot more food. And and also, um, I was thinking about getting more seeds in here, like plant seeds, because this is the first modded series I've ever done. Like. Yeah, this is Kabamon, and we're gonna have a bunch of mods in it. And we're not gonna have any mobs. Oh, yeah, so here, guys, um, here's another mod that I enabled. Yep, it's the Waystone mod. Yeah, it's the Waystone. Yep, um, I got words from my NC Collab friends that this is a pretty good, uh, mod to find out where your, your base is and everything. Yeah, it's actually a pretty cool mod. So I decided to give this mod a try and yeah, I think I want to go with that. All right, so, uh, oh yeah, if you probably noticed that there are some custom biomes in this as well. Yes, yes, it's a, um, it's a mod. It's a mod called um this, this is Terror Terry left. Yeah, this is what the mod is like. And you already see some other mods as well. Like Traveler's Backpack, for instance, because it would be awesome to go explore for a bit. Yeah, these are the mods that I'm using. And I might install more mods. Who knows, guys? It's only game night, so... Um, by the way, I will not be spawning, uh, phantoms and stuff, so phantoms will be leaving me alone, so that is good. 
Oh, phantoms are really out of the picture for this. Alright, copper ores. Yeah, we got copper. Actually, um, alright guys, I'm back, and yeah, I've been smelting copper, and we made a full set of copper armor, just, <laughs> I mean, it looks so cool on me, but it has, like, the same, uh, armor toughness as iron, so that's why, that's why I wanted to use it, and besides, I look orange, yeah, I look orange, that's what, uh, that's the true form of modded right there. There are still mobs here, so, yeah. Um, I was gonna turn off their spawns, but I really do need some mob drops as well. But just remember, this is Pokemon, and we're going. This is gonna be about like Pokemon and stuff, and other mods, along with it. But I really shouldn't be worried about like mobs and stuff. And in the meantime, I'm probably am going to to install some mods, uh, more mods, because I do want. To, to try out some other ones. And also, uh, never mind the white, uh, you, uh, the white, and I will get, get rid of it here soon. Because I need to go install vanilla tweaks on there. But yeah, I probably need to. I probably need to set my spawn real quick. Because I see a skeleton right up here. Come here, you. Alright. But I do like to get some XP. Alright, we don't need that. Alright, we got a Patrat. Why we can get some items? That's probably one of the reasons why Kabumon's still unstable. Because we don't have... What's this? Oh, it's a Sunstone! We got a Sunstone! That's nice. Alright, we are on the Highlands biome. I assume this is where... Oh, is that Red Apricorns? Oh, yes, this is Red Apricorns. Yeah, if you find Red Apricorns, you should be sad. Oh! I saw you, Creeper. So, if you, if you see Red Apricorns like this... Red apricorns, make sure you get them because they can be used to make pokeballs. Yep, they can. All right, all right, guys, I'm back after some time has passed. Um, I did a little bit of off-screen gameplay for a little bit. If you're really nice, oh yeah, I've already set up a apricorn farm. Yeah, I went and grabbed every single sprout. I went into the, I went into uh, the world over there. And found some sprout and got some sprouts from these trees inside the growth zone. So yeah, yeah, we got a apple corn farm set up. So so now we can you we can uh, right click on the stuff and sometimes you will get the sprouts from them. It's kind of cool because I like when you get the sprouts. Well, and you probably know that you have to use apple corns in order to. Make Pokeballs. <laughs> yeah, um, now you're probably wondering, what the heck is all these emerald green stuff? Oh yeah, it's emerald, it's emerald tools. <laughs> I know, it's not really in vanilla, but you do know that this is modded, so I added in the more tools mod. Yep. So we got, so we got an... And also, let's see. Oh, yeah. Wow! I think that sword looks cool on with me. Look at that sword. Oh. Oh, man. Oh, it's blue. And it matches me very well. What? Well, good. I need to find more lapis anyway, so... Alright guys, I'm back, and as you can see, I've already made a nether portal that went to nether. Um, and we got so many apricorns right now, and yeah, I got a lot of pokeballs, a lot of quick balls, yeah. It's pretty cool. But, but there's something else I want to do this episode. Well, 
Well, because I've been digging down here. Oh yeah, we're gonna go down here. Oh. Oh yeah, there's a zombie spawner here. Okay, guys, I'm back after some time has passed. Uh, I went ahead and uh, I did a lot of mining off screen. <laughs> yeah, well, look at all this cobblestone I got. Yep, I got a whole bunch of cobblestone when I was mining. Yeah. Yeah, because I'm actually going to do something in this episode that might surprise you. So, so of course, we have this monster spawner over here. And you're probably wondering how I got it up here. Well, I'll show you. I'll show you how I got it up here. I got it like this! <laughs> yeah, because this is a mod. It's called Carrion On, and you can carry, like, any blocks. Even spawners. It's kind of cool. Yeah. And also, another thing, we're actually going to not have mobs turn on, so the only mobs will only spawn is from spawners. And in fact, I'm actually going to install a mod where I'm going to do like every monster spawner, every mob spawner in the game. So once I pick up like a, a mob spawner and try to get myself a spawn egg, I will switch to that mob and, and switch it to that farm. And I think it's a pretty good idea because remember guys, this is modded Minecraft because I want to do things modded, not like actual vanilla stuff. So yeah, that's why you see a spawner here. So, let's go ahead and start building this, um, yeah, just so we can get an early XP farm going. Yeah, if you probably noticed, I got a bunch of iron chests, yeah. <laughs> I know, because I've been mining a lot of iron early on. Yeah, and we got these fancy new tools, like emeralds and lapis and amethyst, yeah. I don't have any redstone yet, but I do. Also, I got this TR from a wild Pokemon because they're actually going to fucking drop these. Thanks to us. another mod I installed, which I know the creators have a plan. I know the creators uh, will, will add these in the, the mod eventually, so of course they still are working on stuff behind the scenes of this whole thing. And that's why you still see some of the substitute dolls around. Like when you substitute a bad Yeah. But yeah, we're gonna go ahead and make this. Um, I need a soul sand. I need some kelp. I need another water bucket. I'll put... Got two of these right now. Yeah, if you've probably noticed, I'm not playing around with the, the UI, because I'm pretty sure sod sodium is lagging it for some reason. But yeah, we got like these two subs too. Yeah. Yeah, there are some Pokemon that don't have models yet, but they will. They will add models. Alright guys, I got this whole thing set up. Um, yeah. <laughs> It's so weird because you can see a, a spawner. Also, if you probably notice this backpack behind me, um, it's extra inventory. Yeah, it's a backpack mod. Yeah, it's pretty cool. <laughs> okay, you can hold it on your back. Yeah, it looks pretty cool. Oh yeah, and also with the new tools and, am and armor, you'll see. Yeah. Make it some uh, glass because I'm gonna make some. I'm gonna make some tinted glass. Hey right, guys, I got this uh, this uh, killing area good. I went and slabbed it just so I don't get baby zombies to spawn here. And I see, oh, if you didn't see it, but I saw this munchlax roaming around and I decided to catch it because I have these quick balls, of course, because of these apple corn farms. And so I just caught it, yep. Yep, and I try to use it in battle, I use its metronome, because I taught it the metronome. Because you can reteach your Pokemon moves. Alright. Yeah, it's a pretty good attack. Oh yeah, if you already noticed, this Hitmonchan right here, I call this guy 
a little powerhouse. A two he is. Yeah. Because just look at this guy. He's got all the punchy moves. Because thanks to its ability, I am fierce. Yeah. And as power up punch, just to raise its attack. Yeah. I got a bunch of punchy moves. You have a hit on Chan, you better go with this move. Uh, hit on Chan, use bullet punch! Okay, guys, I'm back, and as you can see, um, this, the farm's been set up. Yep. Alright, I, I gotta see this real quick. I gotta see this real quick. I'm actually gonna go up. So eventually I have to push each other. Because I don't have Soul Touch yet, so... I don't have Soul Touch yet, so this might be a problem. So... Yeah. Because this first episode wasn't really any game anywhere with Soul Touch. But hey, at least I got a farm. Hey, at least I got a farm now. Hey, at least I got a farm. An XP farm really early on. That's good. I mean, that's good because I want to do some more stuff with that. And we'll get a hopper system here. Don't worry. Don't you worry, guys. We will be getting a hopper system. But hey, at least this farm works. And as well as <laughs> I caught another rare drop of rare Pokemon. I caught this Dratini. Well, now it's a Dragonair because it was a uh, level 30 when I caught it. So I evolved it. Yeah, so I have a Dragonair. Pretty cool size. Pretty cool size, I say so myself. <laughs> Alright. Oh yeah, but I think I'll show you the team. I think I'll pull up the rest of the team. Alright. Yeah, this is the team so far, so don't worry about that, but... Um... This is probably an epic first episode because I got a really good amount of Pokemon right here. And trying to get like mods and stuff. So, so yeah. Anyways, guys, I think I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna go ahead and end this video here. And thank you all for watching this first episode of Cobblemon. And more episodes will be coming here. And also, if you ask me, also, also, do not ask me. Do not ask me to join an SMP right now, because I'm kind of new to Cobblemon, and I like to learn stuff all by myself. First, before I go into SMPs with other people. And even so, but... I know they they are working a lot on this mod, so I'll... I'll see what kind of updates are going to come out, come out with this, but... I hope you like all the mods I add on here. Like, we got this chisel mod, yeah. Which I can't wait to build something with in the next episode, but... Anyways, guys, um, if you have Discord, you go join my Discord server, as well as go follow me on Twitch as well. Um, so, anyways, guys, I think I'll... Anyway, anyways, guys, I'll see you all later. Bye-bye.